YouTube, it's your boy 392 Sean, man. I'm back with another video. Hey, so this is like a little vlog, a little journey of what's going on, man. So if y'all don't follow me on Instagram, you got to scat over there, bro. You know what I'm saying? Scat still over there, sitting nice, looking pretty, looking thing, thing. You know what I'm saying? But right now, I'm up at my job. It's the weekend. You know what I'm saying? Matter of fact, let me turn the camera around. Yeah. Yes, yeah, so I'm up at my job. Um, you haven't followed me on Instagram, bro. I'm leaving Dodge. Shut your brain, man. It's emotional. I ain't gonna lie. I'm kind of, I'm sad as hell, low key. I'm like, damn, you know, I, um, I did a lot to this car. You know what I'm saying? I did a lot to the car. I put in a lot of money for the car. And the car got me where I'm at right now, you know, almost at 20K on Instagram, 4 point, what, 51K on YouTube, you know what I'm saying? The car gave me a long way, but I just want to try something new because when I was young, I ain't gonna lie, 2007 transform first drop, and I seen you bumblebee. Oh, nigga, bruh. I fucking fell in love with Camaros. I fell in love with Camaro. But as I grew older, I kind of transitioned over to Dodge. And the reason why I transitioned over to Dodge is because of the supercharger line because I thought every Dodge did have one, but I didn't really know too much about Dodge until I did my research. And I got a on one of my dream cars. And I ain't gonna lie, it was, it was a fun build. Everything was completely good. The car treated me well, the car's still good, but it's time to switch over, man. It's time to, time to switch teams, you know, I try something new. And you know, if y'all really mess with me, you know what I'm saying, with the content and stuff like that, you know, you'll still stay around. But hey, you wanna follow me for the scat, I don't know what to say, man. So, cause right now, the car, I got a good deal on it, bro. I ain't gonna lie, I got a good deal, but I'm gonna say it all that for another video. I'm gonna save all that, I'm gonna show y'all the car. So, here you go, here you go the car right here. 2019 SS, where the keys at? What's up, which? 2019 SS, 10 speed. My car has like, 47,000 miles and everybody know that my car has been into a car wreck. But Dodge still off of them rack A's up, man. I ain't gonna lie to you. Dodge still off them racks. So, y'all ain't gonna never believe how much I'm getting this car for, bro. Y'all ain't gonna never believe it. But as of right now, I'm finna take the car on a test drive. Cause it said I got permission to. So, we gonna, we gonna see. All right, y'all, so I'm on a test drive now, bro. Let's go ahead and put this drive mode, engine, and track. Open up the valves. We most definitely going to track. Steering on sport. Let's get it, man. Yeah, so they only gave me 20 minutes, sadly. So with me having 20 minutes, I can't really do too much as if I really wanted to. Scatty right there. But man, make sure y'all, you know, y'all like, comment, subscribe, man. If y'all liking the content and stuff like that, bro, you know what I'm talking about? So let's go ahead and get this started. Hold on, man. Make sure they out the way. I'm so used to having like back windows. I was gonna roll the back windows down so y'all get it all. Feisty. Trying to see which way I'm gonna go. I'll go this way. probably need some tires because like hitting on it i don't know if y'all just seen it like went a little to the side and a little to the other side but i kept it in the road so other than me putting it in track let me put it in sport and let me see something see you see that that that's blinking that it's very blinking Turn TC on. Alright, so TC on. 
But yeah, I ain't gonna lie. This is my, I ain't gonna lie. I think this is my first time driving a 10 speed Camaro. Yeah, this is my first time driving a 10 speed Camaro. So, and it got 87 in here. So it feels sluggish a little bit. It does feel a little sluggish. That's why when I do get this car, I'm gonna drain that 87 out. I'm gonna see the road the whole day and um, put in 93 so I can get the full experience of it. But as of right now, not gonna lie, I'm used to the seating. I ain't gonna say, you know, seating trash and stuff like that. Once I get used to like, you know, looking in the mirror and stuff, what you gonna do? And you didn't yield, dumbass. Yeah, this thing gonna need some tires bad, bro, because I ain't gonna lie, I am spinning. I'm spinning bad. Can't even hold you, I'm spinning bad. That boy, that boy spinning. That boy spinning. Look at that. <laughs> I ain't never spin this bad in the scat for real. Unless it's raining. And I wanted to spin. It gets up the speed. It gets up the speed way quicker than the scat. And that's that's what I'm liking. That's exactly what I'm liking. Not to sound like Cat Williams or nothing, but that's exactly, that's exactly what I'm looking for, face side. I got to hit the interstate for one time. Got to hit the interstate for one time. All right, I'm gonna do like a little 60 roll real quick. Let me see something. Yeah, like I... This one's gonna be a 40, hold on. But yeah, man, as of right now, bro, I'm in love with this car already. Like, I'm in, I'm in love with this car, bro. The car ain't no hope. I'm gonna keep it above with you. The car ain't no hope. Man. At first, when I, like, when I was thinking about it, I was like, you know, I got to learn the gears and learn how, you know, so when I be, you know, not illegal racing, but, you know, racing on the track, on the track, I need to be in the right gears and stuff, bro. It's just like a dodge. When you slap it in manual, I don't know if you dodge on this and stuff like that. No, once you slapping it, um, you don't got to slap your car manual. But when you have your car in drive with scats and Hellcats and stuff like that, if you hold the paddle shift for like two seconds, it's going to drop to the lowest gear. It's going to drop to the right gear, right RPMs, and it's going to go for you. But with Chevy, you put it in manual. And once you um put it in manual, you hold the paddle shifter for like, you know, the same two seconds, three seconds. It's gonna drop to the right gear and right RPMs. And when you, you know, you do your three horns and you honk off, you hit it, slap back and drive, let it shift yourself. And it's getting up there. It's getting up there. But I say with this head drive, the only thing I am concerned about is my, um, it's the tires. I say that because like I said, any time that I did, you know, hit it, it kind of like, went sideways a little bit not too much like it just went you know like that a little bit but it wasn't none too crazy for me like to lose it you know what i'm saying for me to lose it maybe if i had traction control off yeah i probably lost that mug but i'm not playing with tc right now until i fully learn the car once i fully learn the car 
that's when you know I break in with traction control and stuff like that, all that blah 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 blah. But as of right now, traction control is not getting cut off. That's all. The but the handling I ain't gonna lie, the handling seemed good. Besides the you know. This motherfucker is breaking traction, bro. Because that's what just happened. I thought the car like just went limp or something like that. Hopefully my arm in the way wasn't in the way. But that traction light came on. Like it's trying to catch traction, bro. So this motherfucker dangerous. Bro, you better get out of the way, man. I ain't gonna hit you, but just got out the way. Windows down, I'm gonna let it rip again, man. Hold on, I'm gonna let it rip again. Sadly, the test drive only lasts 20 minutes. I wish it was 24 hours, because I ain't gonna lie. I kind of, I wish it was an hour or so. If it was an hour, I would've, would've been excited, because I'm having fun. I ain't gonna lie to you, I, ain't, I am having fun. But, man, are y'all sad to see the scat go? Or do y'all want the scat to stay? It don't matter, though. And then I'm gaining money off the scat, too. I don't know, bro, I ain't gonna, I'm hurt to see it go. Like, cause you know, like I said, I put a lot of money in that car and the car got to be, got me where I'm at right now. But I am not disappointed. I am not disappointed at all, at all. And I always told my homeboys and stuff like that, that um, I'm miss Ron go 10 speed one day. I you know, was lying. Jenna thought I was gonna stick with Dodge forever, but <laughs> nobody. I am GM now. I am GM now. <laughs> <laughs> I'm the one who knocks. That's a good one, Sean. Good. <laughs> it's like when you do a test drive on a car that's not yours, everybody tends to do stupid stuff that it makes you paranoid that you're gonna crash out. That it bitch shit one time. Yeah, I'm gonna cut the video back on once I get out the car and I'm gonna show y'all the tour of the car real quick. Uh -huh. Good, this is the tour of the car. The two seat. I'm in love already, man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you can. Okay. Let's go, So as of right now, <clears throat> I'm not getting the car right now, but it's in my favor because I did get approved for the car. I ain't gonna tell you how much I got approved for, but I did get approved for the car. Um, Monday, I gotta submit these, the buyer's order to my credit union. Once I submit the buyer's order to my credit union and they see everything and they approve everything, everything should be in the go. Like everything should be in the clear. So they should write me my check so I can come up here, buy the car for now. Um, with my car though, I say with my situation, I might have to sell my car to Dodge first before I can come up here and get the check for that car. And stuff like that, I just ask more questions around when the time comes. But as of right now, man, when it's, it's Sean in the building, man. So it ain't no more, it's your boy 392 Sean, man. <laughs> It's it's your boy one that's Sean man. So let's get ready. Let's do this. New car, new build, new journey, new beginnings. It's over with, man. It is over with. Hey right, y'all, man. So I have been back recording. Well, I haven't been recording, but this is gonna be the outro. So no, oh, put that back. Stop touching things. Yeah, so. Can I get two? What? Yeah. So, as of right now. No. So, god damn, I'm trying to record. <laughs> but as of right now, man, so, your boy, what y'all seen was a test drive. The way it's looking, nine times out of ten, the car mines, you know what I'm saying? So, 
Your ball will be one SS, Sean. These are the final moments with the Scatty Pack. You know what I'm saying? The last time I was able to call him a Dodge brother. I don't care. He cares, but he act like he don't care. He's emotional too. Um. My car is gone. Yeah, so. Y'all notice. So you boy. Last time you'll see the car, man. So. It's a sad thing to see. Very sad thing to see. How you feel about the scat going bye bye, man? You know what I'm saying? I don't care. <laughs> as long as you got a car. Why don't you care? Because that's what you wanted. You got what you wanted. I'm proud of you. All right. Well, he said he don't care. As long as I got Did a car. Did you at least clean the engine, baby? No. It didn't do nothing. Nothing. They were so stuck on the inside being so clean. It was like you kept up with the car. So, but make sure y'all like, what comment. About the, uh the other stuff. The red? I know, nigga, the, the, the ones you got at the house. This, that light up. Talking about the snorkels? Yeah. That was in the red. They got rid of those. You talking about halos? Yeah. I'm selling my halos. How much? Hundo. So, make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, man. I know it's sad to see the scat go. So, but it's only new things, new beginning, new journey, new car, you know what I'm saying? So, it is what it is. I'll catch y'all on the next one, man.